back again with me Bisma so I'm gonna explain what I do in Photoshop first uh, I make a pixel level adjustment uh, I focus uh, for the area around the eyes D uh, this is where I uh, remove uh, Flex and blemishes spots around uh, the eyes then I try to uh, brighten the white area of the eyes here I make a selection using quick adjustment then uh, uh, I'm sorry using quick mess then I'm, mis uh, I'm making an adjustment layer using hue saturation uh, to brighten the white part of the eyes and then uh, I try to adjust the color of the iris uh, I try to make uh, the uh, existing color become more uh, pronounced uh, more depth and more contrast only in the iris area uh, and then here I'm uh, not uh, satisfied with the uh, dark uh, or spot uh, area around uh, the skin uh, so I remove the black spots uh, blemishes and freckles but not uh, the entire uh, skin because I think uh, this uh, kind of skin is uh, is her distinctive uh, feature so it it will not be uh, natural if I completely uh, remove uh, the uh, uh, the spots and freckles on her skin. So I only made a small adjustment, a small removal, uh, only the obvious one. And then here, as I said before, I brighten uh, the uh, eye socket. Uh, previously, the eye socket is too dark. And then I uh, darken uh, the eyebrow and eyelashes. Uh, here, I uh, choose to make an adjustment on her skin tone. Uh, I think uh, her skin tone uh, will, uh, will look more... Uh, flattering if uh, it is more uh, bright so I'm using adjustment layer here using a black and white adjustment choosing uh, the uh, luminosity blending mode and then uh, just the red and yellow uh, next uh, I'm uh, I think the, the the area around the head is uh, less contrasty so I, I I just to deepen the uh, hair color uh, and then uh, here I change the composition by uh, making a, a more tight crop uh, and then I change uh, the lip color uh, because uh, as I said before uh, I think it, it looks like of uh, contrast around uh, the head uh, I just to uh, give the lip color more uh, accent uh, using uh, hue adjustment and then using uh, dodge and burn I try to uh, deepen the uh, depth of the lips here uh, I'm using a curve adjustment to make a small spotlight so uh, the eye uh, the face is brighter than uh, the other area and here I'm using a new filter in Photoshop CS6 to make a, a, a nice blur around uh, her face and this is my last adjustment uh, it's a color adjustment I want to make a more deep uh, shadow, a uh, deep blue on the shadow. And my last adjustment, my last editing is uh, a vignette, and I adjust the uh, vignette. And this is it. Thank you for watching. See you.